Legends, hello legends, welcome back to the channel, John here on a grey and murky day and I've just had the Royal Snail Van out earning its keep, I've just been to our local household waste recycling centre and I've been uploading a few videos recently and a few people have commented on the van, the Royal Snail Van, uh, it's a Fiat Doblo, we're not going to do an in-depth review, that is already on the channel and it's up here, however I just wanted to talk through a few features of what I've added to this van to make it the Royal Snail. Um, it is an ex-Royal Mail van. People were saying, no, John, it can't be. The 09 plate Fiat Doblo was never a Royal Mail van. Yes, it was. It was built as a demo van for Royal Mail. Um, it was sign written up. Uh, it was painted purposefully in postal red in Turkey for uh, the Royal Mail for a show back in 2009. And uh, they never used them, you're right. But this was a Royal Mail van. It was uh, livered up as one and, and it was owned by the Royal Mail for a while. So things I wanted to uh, just point out to you. Uh, we'll start this side then, is this decal. Here it is a decal, it is a sticker. Uh, and it covers the original Royal Mail decal. That is uh, the Royal Snail, that's something that I invented. Uh, with my little Royal Snail decal here and this has been on here about two years now uh, and it's looking still nice and red hasn't faded too much it's faded a wee bit but it's not faded too much we've got the Royal Snail decals on the um, doors here of course on a Royal Mail van you'd have Royal Mail and there would be a gold uh, crown I can't put the crown on the van because uh, I don't have the rights to use the Royal Cipher true story uh, I've got the PSI stickers here uh, I actually had a friend who had a Royal Mail van bring his uh, Royal Mail van over and I copied the PSI's off um, his van uh, this is uh, a special number to me, 233, I won't go into details, um, but I've got it up here, Boss, which is, uh, well, BO is Boston, so I've just put Boss and 233, because obviously I live in Boston in Lincolnshire, you can see how bad that roof is uh, there. Coming around to this side, a little thing I've done is I've actually put a black gel badge on the front instead of the red Fiat badge, um, and same again this side, really, PSI badges uh, on the door, Royal Snail, this is quite a cool little... Uh, thing that I've uh, <laughs> I got this sticker from work warning this shed is alarmed um, Royal Snail and then on the back we've got uh, the Royal Snail decals again there is a Instagram and a Twitter Royal Snail van they're not very active but I've just put them on there because on the back of a Royal Mail van you would have www.royalmail.co.uk there is a limited two sticker I've tried to be funny with it 15 miles an hour uh, I wanted to get 88 miles an hour uh, but uh, I couldn't find one available again I've got the boss decal here the Royal Snail decal and this was a um, campaign that the Royal Mail ran for a little while which was thumbs up for your postie during the COVID-19 pandemic so i've changed it to thumbs up for the snail van and then there's an angry looking panda uh, i could have had jess the cat but i didn't want a black and white cat instead i've got a black and white panda on the back uh, interior wise uh, i've got a few uh, decals on here uh, i've got a few uh, work related stuff which i'm not going to show you um <laughs> but the back of my doors are all decalled up with uh, work related stickers and then in the back uh, it's all cladded out there's a little bit of carpet as well i've got an old keyboard in here at the moment yeah, music keyboard and then some other bits and pieces so that's the back of the van and then let's look inside quick so you can have a look and see what we've got in here uh, I've just given it a hoover out, which is why it's looking a little bit tidier. There's uh, a work-related hat there, which is what I keep with me, um, because I don't want it to get squished. Um, and uh, the interior cockpit as well. So that, it's not, not very exciting in here. One thing I have got in here is a, is a Parrot Bluetooth receiver, and there's the um, uh, microphone there. But that's it. That is the Royal Snail Van, a quick five-minute look at. Let me know what you think. Do you find that uh, a problem? I've got somebody locally who uh, is a neighbour of mine who finds it offensive, genuinely. He doesn't like it. He thinks that uh, I shouldn't be able to have an old Royal Mail van. I shouldn't be able to have Royal Snail on the side uh, because he used to work for Royal Mail and uh, he takes pride in that. I'm obviously not trying to um, take the mick out of anybody. It's just a bit of fun. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments below. Do you like it? or you hate it, let me know. Uh, if you've enjoyed the video, thumbs up please, thumbs up for the snail van. Uh, hang on a minute, we've got to look at this look. 
thumbs up for the snail van uh, if you've not enjoyed it uh, thumbs down i suppose but uh, what else what do you think i can add to this van i was toying with putting the um chevrons on the back like a modern uh, post van let me know in uh, the comments below if you haven't subscribed already please do so if you haven't liked it, the video uh, let me know why uh, loads more content to come but as i say loads of people were asking me questions about the snail van they were asking for details about the decals so i thought in this video i'll just um show them quick have a great day whatever you're getting up to take care and goodbye